time, and I never saw seals before. The excitement builds as several hundred people wait along this Biddeford beach to see the final five seals released into the ocean. I think it's really sad that they're being that this is the last one. So this is actually my first and last seal release, and I'm really looking forward to it. You've helped us to release back 1,100 animals, um, and these are the last five. And we couldn't have done it without each and every one of you. So thank you so 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 much. The staff with the Marine Animal Rehabilitation Center finally bring out the guests of honor. A few of the little guys are hesitant. One has to be forced out of his cage. But in the end, they squirm down the beach and into the water. And for some, tonight was not just about releasing the seals. It was about making a statement about the MARK program. Uh, it's a celebration, but it's bittersweet. We understand that. It's uh, saying goodbye, celebrating the successes over the last 13 years. Ed Bilski, a vice president at the university, says the MARK program has been dismantled because after 13 years of seal rehabilitation, the animals are no longer endangered. He says the school will continue to steady seals and promote conservation. Uh, you can see by the showing, there's you know, tremendous enthusiasm, not just from our students and alumni, but the staff and also the volunteers that made this such a very special program. The community saying a final farewell as the last seals head home. In Biddeford, Shanae Williams, WMTW News 8.